check out the new sidecar I built real quick in about five minutes. <laughs> now all these, I got this used on Facebook Marketplace last year, and my dog, my 11-year-old rat terrier, MJ, is terrified of it. He didn't like getting pulled from behind, so I kind of put it on a bike on the side, and he didn't mind it as much, but he still jumped out. But I have noticed, like, when they're being drugged from behind, that's kind of when a lot of these are getting wasted and um, not used very much because the dogs aren't liking them. They're so far away from you back here. And normally a dog likes to be in front of you. So I, I got a cargo bike that I'm also working on, and it's um, got like a front bed on it in front of you. So I'm hoping both dogs can jump on and it's a low platform bed. It's a an old worksman cargo bike. And um yeah, I can't wait to get that going, a motor and a battery on that thing and get that out. But I thought this was a good idea so far, so good. One test ride. I just put like a zip tied on here and um wire, metal wire and electrical tape there, and also metal wire and electrical tape around there for right now. I do have that little, little attachment piece that I got. So it's like the axle wasn't long enough to attach and it wasn't, I wasn't able to put it in a good spot. So I just temporarily did that. I'll get better um, brackets. I just got these U brackets for now, just kind of to get the concept of it and got a, um, a swivel caster wheel. So with that and that metal piece, it keeps it away from the bike, lines it up perfect. I don't even have to use the kickstand anymore. And my nephew wrecked this bike yesterday. Unfortunately, he whiskey throttled it. He's still a little young. He still could hardly sit on the seat. But my niece has been riding it all over. So he's kind of, I thought, maybe getting jealous. So I really said, you know, try it out. But he really didn't want to try it out. That was for a reason. He ended up wrecking it. And uh, it didn't do too much. It, um, the pedal protected it. So the pedal, this this part of the battery got a little messed up and loose. The seat scratched up a little bit, and then this end cap here. Those that's the two that took the brunt of the force. The frame didn't get affected, and um, yeah, hopefully the dogs like this. So far, so good. Got one thirty-five pound dog in it, and um, it didn't break. So gonna take one last test ride and then think of ideas to um, you know permanently do that I guess not permanently because I want to take it back off the bike um, maybe just do this every time before a ride I don't know what do you guys think let me know but be nice